So last night I had a weird dream and it's nothing to joke about so that's why I'm here to share it. So in this dream I initially was at a school campus and they had us um, doing some type of program to celebrate Halloween but in that dream my position was to do the literal opposite. Um, they had me uh, basically pull this type of dance group together. Um, I can't remember that exact position, but I know for sure they were planning to celebrate Halloween. It got to the point where all of a sudden the scene switches in the dream. We are still at a school and everybody is panicking because we are seeing helicopters flying above the school campus. You guys, oh my gosh the helicopters that were flying above the school were dropping fire like literally fireballs i don't know what that meant i didn't understand it and um i remember myself outside of the building and running back into the building in the building i only saw one familiar face this was a friend of mine from a couple years ago we are no longer friends we don't even talk um <clears throat> and in this dream uh, we were trying to find a place to hide. Um, I remember everybody at one point in this dream at the campus. It was like we were in a cafeteria, mind you. The, the tables and everything were already put up. We were all laid out on the floor. We were all laid out on the floor because it was like kind of like a drill situation that was going on in this campus, you guys. Next thing I know, um, me and a couple of people, including the familiar face that I saw, ran into the restroom. We ran into the restroom to hide, to duck out. But one thing I paid attention, I saw in this dream was that even the restrooms was not a hiding place. The windows of the restroom were like, like tall, like it covered the whole wall. Like it was all windows, no wall. Like it was so exposed to the point where I think God was trying to say in that particular scene that there is nowhere you can hide. So it got to the point where, like I said, everybody was literally laid down on the floor flat, laid down face flat on the floor. And the helicopters were beginning to land. And then the, the people in the helicopters were coming out with guns and they were getting ready. And for some reason, the next thing I saw was the people I was in a building with, they started getting up and uh, positioning themselves to shoot too. I'm so confused because I'm thinking I had a school. Then it comes to the point where I remember myself running into, and I remember this clearly because I don't know why there was a stench but I ran into the male restroom trying to hide because earlier the restroom my friends and I went in was a, a female restroom trying to hide. The male restroom was just the same. Windows was open and every, I mean, I, like, I, mean, I don't mean the windows were open. The walls were windows. It was literally exposed. The Lord wants us to pray. Pray, y'all. Pray for your children, you guys. Y'all know we about to go back to school. And um, like I said, prior to the whole shootout, I rebuke it because it didn't even happen. There was no actual shootout. It didn't. It didn't. It didn't manifest. But it was. Um, you know, it was um, about to. And I woke up prior to the shootout actually shooting out. You know what I mean? Immediately when I woke up, I got into prayer because I'm not about to play. I'm not about to play with the enemy. The enemy is a liar. I rebuke every plan of the enemy for when for back to school. I rebuke every plan of the enemy for uh, our children. Oh my gosh, every mass shooting. Like you need to be praying over your children now. I mean, I, I looked at the dates. For when is October? When is Halloween? It's on a Tuesday, on a school day. Let's talk about it. Man, if this is the plan of the enemy, because you guys know something about God, he going to expose the enemy. He going to expose the plan the enemy has. He will tell his saints what to pray about. And right here, right now, this is your prayer point. Pray for your children. Pray, 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 pray. And God just bless you as you obey in Jesus' mighty name. Amen.